this is a review of my electric Q EQDWTTGF dishwasher. Now, go for the programs. P1 stands for program one, which is the Eco Wash, which is two hours and forty minutes. DF uh, F button stands for function. Press it once. This one is just to activate the cell there at the end of the cycle so it'll leave the steam out. You press it again, it'll be the extra drying mode, so we'll add extra drying to the cycle when it's finished. And the eco cycle will be used for just um you could use it for heavily soiled items because it is it is a long wash. P2, which is an hour wash. It's uh, taking one hour and it would be for medium soiled items. It'll be for medium soiled items and just your everyday wear. P3 stands for program three. It is a 29 minute quick wash and it is great just for very lightly soiled stuff like a plate or cups and glasses. This one is the glass cycle. No, sorry, it is the fruit wash. And it's a hot rinse. When you press it once, and when you press it twice, it is a cold rinse. The next cycle is a baby care cycle, which takes two hours, but this is on, sorry. It takes two hours and it's great for baby um, baby bottles or heavily soiled items. The glass is cycle, which takes one hour and 30 minutes. Uh, it's good for stemware or just glasses. Now your energy rating is an A and your noise decibels is 58 decibels. Two place setting, it's a B in drying and annually for all the water you use would be 1,400. Now we have, we have this dishwasher for um, since actually December and it's really good, really handy to use, everything comes out really clean. You could fit a lot in this dishwasher actually. You can actually fit a lot in this. And yep, yeah, so the eco the eco wash. I'll just go the eco wash and the temperature for that is 55 degrees. The one hour wash is 50 degrees. The rapid cycle is 45 degrees. Um the fruit wash for hot is actually 36 degrees and the fruit wash cold is cold like and the baby care cycle is 69 degrees and the glass cycle is 50 degrees. Now, as you can see, it is, there, is, there is dirty dishes inside here which need a wash. And we we'll put that on. The tablet is down there because there is no dispenser so you put in there and we we'll close it or it goes down to the bottom. Your filter is down there. There, we must fill it up first. Now, of course, that's not that's not how much goes in there, but I just left a small bit out so I could just show you how you fill it. Now for this wash we're going to use uh, we're going to use the eco wash which takes two hours and forty minutes and we'll just put on the actually we want just we'll start from there. And I don't know, can you see, but there is a valve at the left there, which is filling up with the water. And which is a really nice touch is the LED light, which comes on when you open the door. And during the cycle, it only stays on for about four or five minutes.
Oh yeah, I forgot to mean, see with the glass, with the baby care cycle and the glass cycle, you see the steam mark. And when you see the steam mark, it means there's gonna be steam added to the cycle before it starts. And I don't know why they have it on the eco cycle, but there is steam going to be added to it during the cycle, which I'll show you there now when it starts steaming. If you can hear, it's just boiling the water, which is making this steam. See, there's steam coming up the side. It is a great dishwasher and mostly we actually do use the eco cycle a lot. We do, we do use the eco cycle a lot actually. And you know if we're in a rush we will use the 30 minute quick wash, no 29 minute quick wash. But we use the baby cycle actually, do you know for like the grill trays which are all fatty and all that. We put them in and all it is so powerful. If you put your hand there like it just it would nearly get you push it, I can't even the door does not open. It is so powerful, the water, but everything comes out spotless. It gets a lot, of, a lot of use. It could be on one or two times a day. Sometimes it could only be on for maybe three times a week. So we do have a big dishwasher back there. This is only like for the extra stuff. Like if there's a party on, we could do put the glasses in there. Or if there's stuff that won't fit in the dishwasher, we'll just put them in here. And the dishwasher outside in the kitchen, I'll be making a video and a review video and an overview on that and the
Yeah, it's just about to start washing there now. It's just filling up with water. Turn on the light again. If, you, if the light does go off in this dishwasher, all you have to do is press the function button. It turns back on again. This machine for every cycle does take five litres. You can see there's a tap jet, but it doesn't spin around that much. But yeah, it is very powerful. Now I do have a bowl which has stuck on porridge. It has a porridge but has a uh, what is stuck onto the bowl and I'll make a separate video on that when the dishwasher has finished on the results. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching and we'll see you soon.